pinnacle of my genius. Unmatched power and impenetrable defense. If I can show him my tech skills, he'll have to notice me. Please, Shuri. Doom's not interested in your gadgets. Watch and learn how to really get his attention. Hey there, big guy. Nice suit. I bet it looks even better up close. Lord Doom, allow me to enhance your suit with Wakandan technology. I could make it even more powerful. Enough. Your attempts to impress me are futile. I am Doom. I need no allies, but I do enjoy the chaos you bring. Surprise, Doom! Did you miss me? Oh, Gwen, sweetie, don't you know? It takes more than a little acrobatics to impress a man of Doom's stature. Intelligence and elegance, darling. That's what Doom truly desires. You both amuse me. But if you think these parlor tricks will win my favor, you are mistaken. This is ridiculous. Why does he always get the girls? You two really are relentless, aren't you? Only for you, Doom. Consider us devoted admirers. Doom, I've been looking for you. Oh, Shuri. Always trying to steal my thunder. I was just about to have a private moment with Doom myself. This isn't a competition, Emma. Oh, but it is, dear. And I always play to win. I bring innovation, technology, and strategy. I could help you achieve greatness, Doom. And I bring power, influence, and intellect. Imagine what we could accomplish together. Why is it always him? Why does Doom get all the attention? Stupid green metal head. Enough. I care not for your petty rivalries. If you wish to prove your worth, do so through actions, not words. the only one who can handle a little adventure, Doom. I thought you could use some assistance. Please, Wonder Woman. You think flips are going to impress him? It's all about strategy and precision. How's that for strategy, Black Widow? You're still thinking too small, Wonder Woman. Doom needs someone who can think ahead, anticipate every move. Your attempts to impress me are amusing, but I suggest you focus on the task at hand. We are not here for games. Oh, we're just getting started, Doom. Consider this a friendly competition. Come on, Doom. This sewer crawl needs some excitement. How about I take the lead? You'll be impressed. Doom doesn't need circus tricks, Gwen. I can lead us to the relic. Wakandan tech is flawless in situations like this. You both waste your energy. This relic does not care for bravado or gadgets. I think you're just playing hard to get, Doom. Admit it, you're impressed with how I dodge these traps. You're lucky I'm here. Your antics are mildly amusing, but unnecessary. Focus on the task, or I will proceed without you. See? Doom knows efficiency when he sees it. We could achieve so much together. Fine, fine. I'll focus. But admit it, this place would be way more boring without me. Enough games. The relic lies ahead. Let us retrieve it without further distractions. Your competitiveness serves no purpose here. Fools. They are but pawns in my grand design. Lord Doom, I offer you the strength of Wakanda's technology. With me by your side, 
we could harness the full power of vibranium and conquer any foe. Please, Shuri. Doom doesn't need gadgets. He needs someone with true power, someone who can wield the minds of others and manipulate them to his will. And you think mind tricks are better than real-world strategy and innovation? I think they're exactly what Doom needs. Enough of this! Why does Doom get all the attention? I've had it with being ignored. Why don't any of you ever see me? This bickering is beneath me. I have no need for petty squabbles. Leave me, all of you. Your antics have amused me, but I tire of this game. Come on, ladies. Cut me some slack, will ya? I told you, I already have a girlfriend. But we're just here for a little fun, PLV. Don't be such a scaredy cat. We promise it won't hurt. Much. Not the time for games, Emma. And stop calling me PLV. That's not even a name. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold on a second. Oh, come on! Not my McLaren! PLV, are you okay? Say something. Don't worry. We'll make it all better. All right, all right. Enough with the kisses. I get it. Ah, look at him go. He's so cute when he's flustered. You have to admit, he keeps things interesting. You two are crazy. But I gotta admit, you make life unpredictable. Finally, some peace. Those two are relentless, but they can't catch me up here. Hey, PLV, miss us? You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? All right, think, Pilverine. Think. They're faster. They're crazier. But maybe I can outsmart them. Let's see how you handle Mysterio's goons, ladies. Is he really leading us to Mysterio's base? This might get interesting. I love a good party. Let's crash it. Just a little closer. Come on. Hey, no fair. You can't just run away. Looks like the cat got away this time. But don't worry, PLV. We'll catch you later. Well, that was fun. What's next, Emma? Well, well, look who decided to drop in. You look like you've been through a war zone. Or a very intense obstacle course. What happened, Pilverine? You run into some trouble? Trouble? Trouble doesn't even begin to cover it. The girls on this island have gone completely nuts. Gwenpool and Emma Frost, they're chasing me like I'm the last piece of meat in a dog park, trying to kiss me to death. Oh man, Pilverine, getting chased by a couple of love-struck ladies? That's a new one, even for you. Girl troubles, huh? Didn't think you'd be the type to run from that. Hey, it's not funny! You try dodging rockets and laser beams while they're blowing kisses at you. I'm not asking for much, just a place to lay low until I can figure out a plan. All right, all right, you can stay. But just remember, this is a secret base. You better not lead anyone here, especially those two. Yeah, and make sure you don't touch anything you're not supposed to. Some of this tech is, let's just say, not exactly foolproof. Thanks, guys. I really appreciate it. I just need to lay low until the chaos blows over. You got it. Just don't make yourself too comfortable. And try not to mess with the suits. They're not as forgiving as you think. Just gotta ride this out. It's all gonna be fine. Just keep my head down and stay out of sight. have I been down here? Feels like hours. Or days. I'm starting to lose track of time. All right. All right. I get it. You're hungry. We're all hungry. Looks like the coast is clear. And besides, Iron Man did say it's a secret base. No one knows where it is. 
I'll just sneak out real quick, grab a bite, and be back before anyone notices. Just a quick trip. In and out. No big deal. See? Nothing to worry about. It's all good. Almost there. Just gotta get some food and get back before... Ah, there's nothing like the smell of victory. Or a hot cheesy pizza. Worth every second of the risk. Look at him. All relaxed and happy. He totally thinks he's in the clear. He's not the sharpest claw in the bunch, is he? But this is perfect. We'll follow him right to his little hidey hole. Ooh, this is gonna be so much fun. Just like hide and seek, but with more explosions. Let's keep it low key for now. We don't wanna spook him before we find out where he's hiding. We need to be quiet and discreet. I'll just grab this slice to go, head back to the basement, and then I'm good. No more crazy chases for me today. He's leading us right to it. I knew this was gonna work. Patience, Gwenpool. Let's not mess this up. We're almost there. All right, finally, some peace and quiet. Just me, this delicious pizza. And mmm, now this is living. No crazy chases, no rockets, just food and... Oh no! Not again! Found you, PLV. You didn't really think you could hide from us, did you? I knew this was a bad idea. I knew it! All right, all right. Enough with the kisses. I'm sorry, okay? I'm out of here. See you soon, Kilby. We're not done yet. I just need a break. Just one moment of peace. Gotcha, Kilby. You're quite popular today, aren't you? Oh, come on. Not you two, too. Enough already? I can't take any more kisses. Is there no escape? No matter what I do, I can't get away. Better run faster, PLV. We're not the only ones looking for you. Hey, Pilverine. Got someone I want you to meet. Can't it wait? These claws won't sharpen themselves. Trust me, you'll want to meet her. Shuri? The Black Panther? The one and only. And you must be Pilverine. Heard a lot about you. All good, I hope. Mostly. So, I was thinking, Shuri here would be the perfect partner for your next mission. You know, to show her the ropes. Sounds like a plan to me. What mission are we talking about? Oh, just a little recon in Doom's village. Nothing too dangerous. I'm sure Pilverine can handle it. With you by his side, of course. I'm up for it. What do you say, Pilverine? Ready to team up? I think we'll make a great team. Great. You two can head out whenever you're ready. This is fine, totally fine. So, over there's where Doom's goons like to hang out. Nasty bunch, but nothing we can't handle. Sounds like you've got this place all figured out. Let's just say I've been here enough times to know the lay of the land. But, uh, don't let the creepy vibes fool you. It's not all bad. So, is this how you usually handle missions? With a side of flirting? Only when the company's worth it. Careful, Pilverine. I might start thinking you brought me here just for the ambiance. And if I did? 
And over there's where Doom supposedly keeps his secret stash of, I don't know, probably something weird like evil ice cream. Evil ice cream? Really? You sure you didn't make that up just to impress me? Maybe, but if I'm lucky, it's working. It's definitely working. You know, I didn't expect this mission to turn into whatever this is. I'm glad you're here, Shuri. This night wouldn't have been the same without you. I'm glad I'm here too, Pilverine. Wait a minute. That doesn't look like Recon. No way. I can't be jealous. I mean, I'm with Deadpool, right? This is just a mission. Nothing more. What you watching, Gwenny? Ooh, is that Pilverine and Shuri? They look all cozy. You think they're gonna kiss or what? Nah, they're just on a mission. Probably nothing. Sure doesn't look like nothing. That's the classic, I like you, but I'm too cool to say it, Stroll. You see the way she's looking at him? That's not recon, that's romance. Well, good for them, I guess. They make a cute couple. Oh, don't sound so heartbroken. You know you've got the best of the best right here. Yeah, of course. So, what's the plan for tonight? You want to blow something up? Maybe prank Iron Man? Uh, maybe later. I'm just trying to figure something out. Cool, cool. I'll be in the rec room if you need me. But seriously, think about the fireworks. It'll be a blast, literally. Why does this bother me so much? I shouldn't care, but I do. Gwenpool. Shuri, what's up? I've noticed something. Every time Pilverine and I get paired up for a mission, you reassign us. It's almost like you're trying to keep us apart. What are you getting at? You're jealous. You don't want me spending time with Pilverine because you have feelings for him. You don't know what you're talking about. Are we going to do this, Gwenpool? Because I won't hold back. Neither will I. Is this really about Pilverine? Or are you just scared of losing control? What's wrong? Scared of a little pussycat? Shut up! You're not fighting me, Gwen. You're fighting yourself. Maybe I am jealous. So what? What the hell is going on here? This isn't how we settle things. Gwenpool has been trying to keep us apart. She thinks I'm getting in the way. Maybe I was. Gwen, you didn't have to do that. I care about you, but there's no need to fight over it. And as for you, Shuri, I've got a special mission planned for tonight. A special mission? What's that about? We're getting close. Stick to the shadows and keep your eyes peeled. Understood. It's beautiful up here. Hard to believe a place like this can exist in the same world as everything else. Even in a place like Doom's Castle, you can find a moment of peace. You're full of surprises, Pilverine. What's next on this so-called mission of yours? Shuri, the truth is, this mission isn't just about Doom's Castle. It's about something more personal. Personal? What do you mean? You'll see. Come on. Pilverine, what is this? This is the real reason I brought you here. I wanted to show you something special and to tell you how I feel. How do you feel? Shuri, ever since we met, I felt something I haven't felt in a long time. I care about you more than I ever thought I could. Pilverine? I'm in love with you, Shuri. And I wanted to show you that even in the darkest places, there's still room for something beautiful. I didn't expect this but I'm glad you brought me here. So am I.